Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you are new here, my name is Krista. Today's video I'm going to be trying out a brand new mascara. It is the Anastasia Lash Brag Volumizing Mascara. So if you want to see me try this out for the first time, then just continue to so keep So I know I just did a review video, but like I said, I did go to Ulta and pick up a couple new products before I wasn't able to anymore and I want to give you guys good content while we're all home and bored so I'm gonna try this new mascara out for you guys today and I uh, just filmed my everyday kind of foundation routine and I'm gonna be putting that up on my Instagram instead of up here I do like little tutorials on there so if you guys are interested in that I will leave my username up here and go ahead and give me a follow I'm gonna go over the claims first and then we'll go ahead and just start trying it out see so I'm just kind of reading it off the box so it's supposed to be volumizing lengthening, long wearing, water resistant, and gluten free and alcohol free. So that's a lot of good claims on there. Does Anastasia already have a mascara? I feel like they don't. I ended up picking up the smallest one. I saw this right up front on display at my Ulta and they did have the full size one, but I want to try the little one out first to actually make sure that I like it. And the little one was $13. The packaging's really cute on it. It's kind of like an ombre type thing. So it goes kind of from a rose gold to black at the top. So the packaging's really nice. I'm gonna show you guys what the wand looks like. Like, it looks pretty good. Like, it would definitely add some volume. We'll see what happens. So I'm gonna zoom you guys in so you can see as I apply it. That is what we are looking like for the first coat. So this is one coat with, and then this is obviously what my lashes look like without. This seems like a really promising, good mascara. I feel like it's grabbing the lashes well. It added a lot of length and yeah, I'm really liking it. So I'm gonna let it dry for a second and then I'm gonna go ahead and apply a second coat. I'm gonna go ahead and apply the second coat so we can see if that makes a big difference. That is what we're looking like for the second coat. And I definitely compared this one to the Lily Lashes mascara. If you guys haven't seen that one, um, I did do a review on that mascara and I will leave it linked below if you wanna watch that as well. But this is adding a lot of volume, a lot of length. It almost makes it look appear like you have false lashes on. So I'm really, really liking this so far. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this on the other eyelash or the other eye that is one coat compared to the two coats I feel like it looks pretty similar but I'm gonna let it just kind of dry down for a second and then I'll go ahead and apply the second coat on this eye all right that is what we're looking like up close so it gave me a lot of volume and it gave me a lot of length and I'm gonna go ahead and try this on the lower lashes as well Definitely only need one coat on the lower lashes, but I like the way that it looks. This is what the lashes are looking like with the top and bottom. Give you a little like side view. Okay guys, so I would definitely recommend going out and buying this mascara. Just like the Lily Lash mascara, that's one of my favorite mascaras and I would put this up to par with that. If you want to, you can obviously try the smaller size like I did to make sure that you like it. But I definitely think that you will if you're a mascara girl and you wear it like every day, I highly recommend this. It almost gave me like a fake lash kind of look without having to wear fake lashes. Anastasia came through. I didn't have like super high hopes for this mascara I thought that it was probably overpriced and you could find one at the drugstore just as good but compared to my drugstore mascaras this one definitely beats it that is going to complete this review I know it was really like kind of a quick video you have one more makeup product that I'm going to review but if you guys have any other videos that you want to see from me while we're all staying home and bored let me know down in the comments below I'll see you guys in my next video very soon 
Bye. Let me know too, I cut my hair. I like it a lot. I'm super happy my hair was a lot longer if you're new here. So let me know, I'm digging it. I love my hair so much. I love the haircut and then I obviously got my highlight redone. So yeah.